Hey everybody, we're jumping into another Easy A LR God Goku Showcase. This time we're going to be taking him against one of his biggest tests, prob probably the biggest test other than Broly. But Broly's not really a fair test to him since he can't, you know, use a major portion of his kit. We're going up against the Metal Cooler Core. So, him being the hardest physical boss in the game, I figured we got to bring Goku in here, we got to see how he does. I wanted to use a little bit of a different team in each of these videos, so this time we're bringing him on the Beast Gohan team. There he is, everybody. Beast Gohan, look at him. There he is, right there in the back, hidden, hidden away from us. We can't, we can't get him there. So, we're bringing him in here. We're gonna bring some Ghost Dushers just in case. Um, I thought about bringing a support memory just for fun, but I don't think I'm going to. Um, and let's just go ahead and hop in. Going to turn intros up. お前が誇り高き最悪人の血を引く者ならば俺の息子ならば誰にも負けることは許さん俺超えてみせます目の前の敵も倒さない殺すロラとやろうぜ一対一にこだわってる場合じゃないだろう Alright, now that we've watched the entire episode of Dragon Ball Super, let's hop in. By the way, uh, Vegeta's speeches, man, every time he speaks, it gets me ready to just like run through a wall. You know, he has so many great moments over the years of just like... Goku, like, he is like Goku's biggest hype man, you know, they're rivals for sure, but you know, on uh, on Namek, he's getting him hyped up, you know, ready to beat Frieza's ass, you know, in the Tournament of Power, he's, uh, hyping him up again there, let's see, let's put Goku here, like, I, I so badly want a support memory, or really I want it as an active skill, because if it's a support memory, then it's not voiced, but honestly, I take it as both, though, of Vegeta giving the Belmod speech of like, you know, in this tournament we've only had 40 minutes and we've been kicking your ass. We've been, you know, pile driving everybody, growing stronger, getting better. And, uh, you know, you just said Goku's form is incomplete, buddy. Uh, what do you think that means? You know, uh, the track record here is uh, not in your favor right now, bud. So, I, listen, I'm super, super excited to see that speech in Dokkan. And then just the way it ends with the UI Goku scream and then just getting powered up to go fight Jiren. Like, man, gets me ready to, you know, it's like, I'm ready, coach. Put me in. I'm ready, Vegeta. It's like, I'll, I'll go I'll go fight him for you. You got me fired up. I'm about to raise my power level. I'm about to trespass into the domain of the gods. Like, dude, that's like the most raw thing you can tell somebody. Like, I, 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 just, I just don't, I don't think it gets more powerful than that. Just, just I'm ready. I'm ready. So, you know, more Vegeta speeches, more of that in Dokkan, please. Just, like, get him, get him speaking to me. I, I need him, I, I need him getting me pumped up for these fights. Alright, so the gods getting supered, that is definitely not ideal. Uh, luckily they were guarding, so it shouldn't be too bad. Hopefully Gohan double supers for us here, so that he can get two stacks. No, but he is at double digits, so that's good, I'll take that. Alright, we're going on to the next rotation. Uh, I, again, I don't... Okay, uh, now that Mr. Mid is over, uh, we can go ahead and get him built up. It's actually good that he's on rotation with this god Goku, so we can actually get him a decent amount of orbs. We can, let's go ahead and build up the friend one, get him ready to go. Uh, we can give... Let's go ahead and do these so that we drop the reds and get those all clustered together so that we can get this other one. Why did they build this guy with so many key issues? Can anybody tell me why this, like, they must not have play tested this guy. They definitely didn't know about Beast Gohan. I, I don't have any insider information, but if I'm just thinking about, like, Toei, 
they were keeping everything under lock and key with this movie. I mean, there were no leaks. I don't remember the exact timeline, but we knew Broly and Gogeta were coming. I mean, that was like rumored, we known. Like, we knew with the Broly movie that it was going to be the Broly movie. Like, that, that was just like a common thing. We, we knew that was happening. This movie, it was like, uh, we, we were taking that one trailer and looking at a two pixel, I'm, I'm squinting my fingers right now, but we're looking at like a tiny little pixelized Broly on Beerus' planet, and we're like, oh, Broly's coming back, what's happening, is Broly gonna go crazy again? Like, there were so many fan theories, nobody knew it was happening in this movie. So, I, I don't think Dokkan knew either. Uh, you know, uh, these, these games are known for having like notorious leaks, data mines, so I'm sure Toei knew that, or whoever is in Shueisha, whoever is in charge of these characters, and didn't want any information getting out early about Beast Gohan, had everything under lock and key, and didn't even tell like these game developers about what was coming in this game. So they probably honestly just slapped on Beast Gohan at the end. That does not excuse this ultimate Gohan from having the worst key issues on a unit that I've seen in a long time. Also, this guy didn't put any dodge on him. That's good to note. Uh, mine, by the way, if you need a reminder, is built with uh, full dodge. I only have one dupe in him. I got extremely shafted on these banners, and I needed to pay off some uh, some loans at the time. So, uh, listen, Dokkan came second in that instance for me. Which, honestly, it probably should for everybody. But, uh, listen, uh, we, don't, we don't talk about this. Don't tell my wife. Um, so... We're going to put Vegeta and Trunks in slot 1, get them fully built up, we can give them all this key. I probably, probably should have saved that for the gods, since this Goku has... You know, this, again, over in a flash, shattering the limit, awful links. I don't know why they gave those to this guy. Um, but I'm going to give him this like red key here so that we can give all the purple. I know that seems counterintuitive, like, oh, give them all these, but I want to give this to the gods so that they can you know stack up some more. Hopefully that's not a super at the end, I just noticed that. I actually didn't think they were getting attacked there. Ooh, look at that dodge. You know, I put like 10 or 11 dodge on my Trunks and Vegeta, and I'm sure somebody thinks that that's a horrible idea. But look at that. We're still getting built up from the other attacks, and we just dodged a super. In my mind, that, that build is completely worth it. Look at them. I just, I love this unit. I'm, uh, let's see, in about a month from now, I'll get to buy or summon two more dupes of them to get them fully rainbowed out. And I am very excited for that. Let's see, hopefully if he's going to double super, he does it against God Goku here, and God Goku just bobs and weaves and dodges it. Uh, like I said, I already pre-made all of the thumbnails for these videos, so I'm kind of hoping that Goku's the MVP for this. Dodge this, please. Dodge this, please. Yeah, there it is. Uh, the uh, thumbnail for this is like Goku as Atlas holding up the uh, holding up the earth, because like we just saw right there, he's just he's carrying the team on his back in this run. Look at that. Look at that amazing dodge right there. You know, people people didn't like my full dodge. They told me that it's a waste. Like, oh, putting dodge on a already on a dodging character already dodges. Oh, and they were like freaking out, dude. Like, but look at that. Look at that. Look what just happened. All right, so this Gohan still has this guard, and he's partially built up. But the key is not very good. Oh man. Uh, what are we going to do here, everybody? I can't put this Gohan in slot 1 yet. I can put him in slot 2 or 3. I kind of want to do this. And leave this God Goku around for rainbow orb changing for this guy. So I think I'll do that. And I'll just go ahead and give him these yellow key for just a little bit of extra healing. Uh, this guy, I can't get two rainbow orbs. That is not good. We'll just give him these. Oof, this is not this is not great. There's a chance we die here. I don't think we will. Just in case I'm gonna use a ghost usher. And we're just gonna give him these orbs so that he can get just a little extra stack. Yeah, I I, I didn't I didn't really want to play around with the core on that turn. I was uh I was looking at it and I I did not like what I was looking at there. Let's see, you know if Gohan had decent key. You know, if he didn't have the worst key mechanic in the world, he, uh... It's really not his key mechanic that's the issue. It's the issue that he has shocking speed as his only key link. That's that's really the detriment here. But it's like, uh, you know, you give him eight key spheres and he's still not at uh, 24 key most of the time. That's absurd. Alright, so he sealed Vegeta and Trunks. That's not the biggest deal in the world. We can do this. 
And uh, I guess let's just go ahead and play the Beast Gohan actor skill. I'll actually play it this time because he hasn't been a detriment. It's listen, I'm actually going to play it this time for real. <laughs> All things considered, that actually is... I do enjoy this OST. I think it's pretty good. Um, let's see. Trunks and Vegeta, they're at 500k defense. They should be fine. They still have their guard. We can give them this. Let's get... Ooh. I do want to stack, so let's go ahead and give them those blues. Then we can give this god Goku this int key sphere. And uh, he's definitely, he's dodging both of those attacks. Uh, guarantee it right now, he's dodging both of those attacks. If he doesn't dodge both of those attacks, you guys have to uh, leave a comment saying he didn't dodge those attacks, you fool. And you have to like the video, so uh, that's what happens. And if he does dodge the attacks, then you have to say, uh, you were right, he dodged. And then you have to like the video twice. You have to go make a second account and like it again. So, that's what you gotta do. Looks like we might have broken the super attack there with uh, Ultimate Gohan. That is, you know, I, I do clown on him a lot, probably more than I should, um, but the, the uh, action break is one of the more powerful abilities they've put in into the game. All right, let's see. Boom, there's one. Ooh. 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 He didn't, he didn't dodge both of them. Ooh. All right, so he didn't dodge both, but it's a good thing he dodged one of them. Uh, <laughs> 200k damage is a lot. Okay, I was not expecting that, but... Man, I'm really glad. Hopefully we broke the core super attack there, because uh, it, we definitely did. That's why you went super on this turn. Lord, that was a lot of damage. Uh, we can go ahead and use this Beast Gohan's active skill too. And the God's active skill. I mean, we can pretty much just clean up here. Um... I'm going to play the gods, and then I'm going to just skip through Gohans, so let's do that. I, uh, I forgot that uh, Metal Cooler wasn't under 50% HP yet. So let's go ahead and turn on the active skill skip. Go ahead and just shoot off this Beast Gohan's right here. And hopefully crits. Nope. He's not crits. Why does that do no damage, man? That You know what, actually? This guy came out like a month before he should have. This guy should have had the standby mechanic. And we should have switched to, like, um, Orange Piccolo while this guy's charging up his, uh, Makon Makonko Sapo. And, uh, we, we, he should have, like, he should have been charging up the, that, Makonko Sapo. He should have been charging that up. It sounds better whenever, like, they actually say it, you know, they hit you with the Makonko Sapo. But calling it, like, the Makonko Sapo just sounds weird. But, um, he should have been, like, charging that while we're in Orange Piccolo for, like, a few turns. Like, just made Orange Piccolo like a tank, you know? Like, he can't attack, because I don't think any of the standby... I guess the Vegeta can attack in standby mode. But they should have made the Orange Piccolo a standby while we're charging that up, and then we get enough key spheres, launch it off, and it does like a billion damage. That's what they should have done with this guy. He came out a month too soon. That's... Listen, I solved it. That's the problem. Alright, we're gonna put this uh, God Goku in slot one. I don't want to give him too many key spheres. Let's just go ahead and give him these blues on the left. We can give these guys. What do we got here? I really need to save key for the friend. He's, well, he's not going to get a super anyway, so it doesn't matter. Let's give the gods this then. And let's just give him, like, uh, this. It doesn't really matter what we give him. So we'll just do that. 
I'll say that's sad. He actually does have his super effective built in. He has his 70% uh, chance, you know, to do an additional super. Because whenever you launch the active skill, it gives you the effects that you get at 24 key. Alright, so this is good. We did get two rainbow key spheres, right? Yep. Yeah. Alright, that's good, that's good. Alright, and the gods are going to come in here and do a ton of damage. We've got them quite a few rainbow key spheres. Yeah, there's a nice crit. It broke his action. Not really going to matter too much because he already supered, but he does get an attack buff on his super. So, you know, uh, any less damage we have to take, the better. We're just going to shred his health there. Hopefully you don't take too much. Oh my goodness! Uh, so, I think we really saw all we needed to see, and um, we saw Goku there. Also, that was the friend, that was the friend, Ultimate Gohan, who did not put dodge on his character, and we died. We died. There was no dodge, we had no chance to live there, because that guy didn't put any dodge on his character. Uh, God Goku dodged an attack that he would have taken 200k from. He's built full dodge. He dodged. He's got built-in dodge, but he also dodged. You can't say that that uh, attack he dodged wasn't from his hidden potential system. You don't know. You don't know. You don't know. It could have been. My dodge build could have saved us uh, 200k damage on the previous turn. Also, Ultimate Gohan took 300k. Are you kidding me? That is the most recent Dokkan Festival's exclusive LR on Global, and he took 300k from the core. That A fight that has been out since, like, September. August. What? Anyway, let me know what you guys think about LR God Goku. Uh, this should probably wrap up the showcases I'm doing with him today. There might be another sometime later this afternoon or this evening. I'm recording this the night before, so we'll see what I'm feeling like whenever I get home. Uh, I'm going to try to get some Int Kid Goku showcases up, um, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.